Now happening today, an all-girls school, brand new, opening in the Aldean ISD. The school's big focus, careers in STEM. Science, technology, engineering, and math. Studies show only 28% of women are in STEM careers. And it's not just a district-wide issue or a statewide issue, it's nationwide. Let's say you want to become an engineer. First of all, people around you, they, they don't look like you. They're, like, they're not the same gender as you. Some young women, they stop themselves at a point where they think, that's as far as I can go. I would not be where I am if I didn't have people beside me and behind me pushing me and encouraging me. Not enough girls are in engineering courses. The girls are going to go into these STEM careers where they're going to need sisters. It's not a competition. I don't want to give them a false hope of everything's going to be great on this path. No, you're going to come across doors that are slammed in your face. I want them to believe that they can do anything that they want to do. That means we're giving them opportunities to become confident and speak boldly, where they have the confidence to take advanced math courses and computer science and technology and work with power tools. I'm learning how to be more comfortable with people and how to communicate more instead of being more like quiet and shy about things. At first, I wanted to do everything alone because I thought, that, I mean, I, I know everything, like, I'm, I'm going to be like better when I do it alone. But then I realized another girl might bring out like another point and they might be like even stronger than yours. If I'm afraid of doing something, if I'm afraid of asking questions, Miss Cooper, Dr. Jackson, and Miss Morris, they make me feel more comfortable. They'll just motivate me to do more. We want them to be the one to set the example and be our trailblazers so they can make their mark in history and leave a legacy behind for tomorrow. If I was younger, I would have said I want to be the first so-and-so in this. But now I feel like not being the first, but like being a part of it. I feel like I will be able to inspire my younger sister. Then when she gets to where I will be, she will be able to inspire and it will just keep going on. We go by the guiding principles called PEARLS, and PEARLS stands for perseverance, excellence, advocacy, resilience, leadership, and sisterhood. They show sisterhood every single day. It's everything I'm doing, is it worth it? If I'm working like long hours, is this benefiting only me or is it also helping others? The challenges and the struggles, it makes it all worth it because I'm gonna be brave enough to step out in the world and help somebody else, pull somebody up beside me and say, hey, you can do this too. That's what makes it worth it. That's what makes it worth it.